Hello, my revivers. Today I'm coming to you with another food haul. It's not a huge food haul, but it's a nice little size food haul. As you know, I try to um, shop for the week and get items that we need to um, fill in if we ran out of stuff like snacks for the kids or for the lunch boxes and stuff like that. So that's kind of what this haul is. No major meats or anything. You guys know I have stopped using the um, meats from all these, uh, the actual not the meats but the chicken wings so um i've been looking at other options at other stores and stuff like that but i still love this ground turkey so far um if that changes i will be changing where i get it from so let's start from this and guys i have always y'all know i gotta have the ginger ale on deck if we want to have some you know a little bit of fizz we go with ginger ale and we love the green teas my husband loved those more than i love them i like the lipton better but he loves those we have the salmon um which is a bigger bag the two pound bag we have the um burrito shells because we're going to be doing a um, mukbang on rizzy's channel but she wanted to make everything so we're going to do tacos and um, burritos and we're gonna do those little um, cinnamon balls with the cream cheese in them but we're gonna go the easy route and we're gonna do it with this um, nice and simple I think that's less than a buck for those biscuits so that was a frugal way to do it um, and then we put the cream cheese sweet cream cheese filling in the middle and fry them like they do at Taco Bell so uh, stay tuned for a video on the DIY on doing those but um yes then we have ice cream bars Rizzy can't have nuts so if we don't get regular ice cream we'll get her those and then we eat these here the Sunday Sunday cones and then we have some vanilla bean ice cream I'm gonna be doing a peach cobbler a really simple peach cobbler they had no frozen peaches so I had to go with the canned peaches and the um, other peaches was like extremely hard and they weren't sweet so I didn't even go with those so I have some oatmeal raisin bread from Wegmans which was um, 550 and they were uh, this was um something I never had before and I love raisin bread so I wanted to try it it was kind of expensive I probably won't get it again unless it's like extreme extremely delicious so ranch we always have to have our ranch I wanted some of these potatoes I wanted to saute them in garlic and um butter and um rosemary and all that good stuff and i have some sour cream for our tacos needed some more coffee if anybody has tried the great value coffee let me know what you think about it um i'm normally using hold on in my k-cup hold on one second i normally use this which is what my um mom-in-law gave me and i really like it because i just add my creamer and it tastes awesome so i wasn't too much into getting flavored coffees because I tried them one time and I didn't like them from Sam's. So I said, I'll get regular coffee and get the creamers that I enjoy. So this was my last K-Cup. So I decided to get this here and hopefully it's a good um, tasting coffee and it's not too bland. And then I'll just add my caramel macchiato or whatever creamer I decide to put with it. So got that. And that was only four something, which was surprising because the 16, um, 18 cups of, uh, Folgers was like nine almost ten bucks so I'm gonna try that first cream cheese for the filling of those biscuit balls cinnamon things we're gonna make yogurts for the uh, hubby and the girls lunch box well the hubby wanted yogurt but the girls can take them for lunch as well cream of wheat because me and the hubby been craving this and I like to make it with like maple brown sugar and cinnamon oh my god so good I will probably do a video on that because someone requested a was it cream of wheat or was it oatmeal or did I do cream of wheat? I don't remember. I'm going to have to see. But I think it was another request for a different type. Because I think I did how to make cream of wheat on here already. And it, like, people love that video. I get a lot of views on that video. Um, So, um, we got turkey. Turkey, ground turkey. These are like $1.89. Some cheese for our tacos. Y'all know I don't do shredded cheese. I like to shred my own cheese. I don't know what it is, but I have been getting cravings. I always love peppermint since I was a little girl, but I always have random cravings for it where I just want to crunch on it, just chew it up and crunch it. Yeah, so got that. Went to go get another pineapple because the pineapple I used for my Queen's Mingle was so freaking sweet and delicious. So I decided to grab another one, and these are like $2.99, I think, which is not bad because the amount of pineapples you get versus buying the cut up pineapples for $5, you might still buy a whole pineapple. Some taco shells, which these were 89 cents a piece. And instead of trying to buy the girls the whole holes and the Twinkie cakes or whatever that I used to buy, trying to go with something a little bit better, baby. 
baby steps, but we're going to get there sooner or later. So I got these, and then I got a variety pack of um, granola bars. We got two apple juices. We got this orange pineapple juice that we never tried, and we're going to see how that tastes. And then we have some hash browns here, and then we have some corn beef hash. I wanted some of that so bad. My hubby had some the other day. We had one can, and I asked him to get a couple bites, and I almost ate it all. I said, okay, let me go get some, because now I want some. So that is my little haul. I did go shopping for some things yesterday, but the kids already done busted some of that stuff open, like these right here. They had to have. I said, okay, just a little bag. We're not getting a big old box. So that is my home and I'm going to put this stuff away and try to share as much of this stuff being put away as I can so let's go get it put away all right guys so I keep extra containers on hand if I find a container that I really love I like to keep extra because according to what you buy this particular grocery haul you may have different items that are different sizes that you need to store differently so always keep extras in a little cabinet somewhere so that way you can interchange the different ones for different items that you're storing and also I like to remove things from boxes because it saves a lot of space versus putting the big containers and all the boxes and packaging in your cabinets or your your refrigerator. I am an avid recycler and guys I've been looking for a nice small recycling bin I found this trash can at Walmart for less than nine bucks I totally love it it does the job well guys if you love this video make sure you thumbs up make sure you share if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe and hit that bell for random videos throughout the week and I will see you guys in the next video later gators my revivers enjoyed this video and if you did i hope you thumbs up and guess what guys this is where your girl is on social media but before you go check out these great videos i have lined up